In today's video, we are going to talk about treatments for stressed cats. Cats can be very sensitive creatures and may often become anxious or frustrated by things going on around them or by the way people interact with them. It's important for you to know if your cat is stressed, especially if you have a domestic cat, they are good at hiding signs that they are stressed or in pain because in the wild this would make them an easier target for predators. It is important that you manage and reduce stress in your cat as much as you can because if your cat is stressed, they can become both emotionally and physically unwell and may develop physical illnesses as well as display problem behavior. Often owners may only notice something is not quite right with their cats when they have already been stressed for some time. Cats may lose their appetite or be sick occasionally or behave in a way that owners have never seen before, such as spraying urine against the wall indoors or behaving aggressively. The sooner you realize that your cat could be experiencing stress, the sooner you can resolve the problem. This means you need to keep a close eye on your cat's physical health as well as their behavior so that anything odd or out of character that could be a sign of stress is quickly identified. Causes of stress in cats Just like people, every cat may react differently to a specific event, item, or person but there are common situations that are more likely to cause stress in your cat. New people and pets Cats are often sensitive to any household changes including when people and pets living in your home come and go. New babies coming home, grandparents coming to live with you, divorce, roommate changes, marriage, new cats and other pets, and even just someone staying for one night can all cause stress in your cat, especially if your cat doesn't already know them. Having company over for holidays is a common issue for many cats since it not only involves new people but many other stressors as well. Construction Odd smells, noises of construction, materials lying around, unfamiliar people, and other things involved with having work done on or around your house can cause stress in your cat. Simply painting a room or doing some light remodeling can trigger stress, so it doesn't have to be a major construction project to cause problems. Animals outside If your cat can hear or smell, and especially if it can see another animal outside it may be stressed. Outside cats are a common trigger for stress in your indoor cat but even being unable to catch birds outside that your cat sees can result in your cat having pent-up stress. Transportation If you have to transport your cat for any reason then stress is a likely occurrence. Not being used to a carrier, the sights and sounds of a car or plane ride or the anticipation of the destination, such as the veterinarian can all cause stress. Other environmental changes Everything from robotic vacuums to Christmas decorations to moving boxes can cause stress in your cat. Changing where your cat's litter box is located, the type of litter that is used, where your cat eats, and even where its favorite scratching posts are located are other examples of environmental changes that can trigger stress in your cat but any type of change in your home is a potential problem. Recognize stress in your cat. Hiding is one of the most obvious signs that your cat is stressed but it's not the only one. Hissing, running away, growling, scratching items, and eliminating outside the litter box can be other signs of stress in your cat and should not be ignored, especially if they are occurring regularly. Monitor your cat for these symptoms and think back to what may have changed before you notice these behaviors. Cats show stress in many ways, and it often comes down to observing changes in normal behavior to determine whether you might be stressed. The catch is that many of these signs can also indicate various medical conditions, so it can sometimes be tricky to sort things out. If you notice any change in behavior in your cat, it's best to consult a veterinarian to rule out medical causes before settling on stress as the diagnosis. The common signs of stress in cats are Inappropriate elimination, inappropriate scratching, diarrhea, hiding or extra clinginess, decreased appetite, over-grooming, sometimes to the point of creating bald spots, often focusing on the legs or belly. Solutions for your stressed cat If you can provide care for your cat that respects its needs, both as a species and an individual, you stand the best chance of preventing or reducing chronic stress. Always remember things that stress your cat could be things that you don't find worrying at all. Thankfully there are a number of things you can do to help your cat if it is stressed. If you can figure out the source of the stress, the best thing to do is to eliminate that source but that isn't always possible. You can't get rid of a family member or new pet or stop construction because your cat is stressed about it but that doesn't mean you can't still help your cat. One of the best ways to protect your cat against possible stress is to try to anticipate the sorts of things that might cause them stress in the first place, such as moving to a new home or the addition of a new cat to the household. Once you have identified possible sources of stress, you can then manage the situation or environment in a way that helps reduce the chances of your cat suffering. Sprays, wipes, and diffusers containing pheromones are good starting points for helping to manage anxiety in your feline friend. 
buy some products that can help cats feel calm and safe but may need to be used alongside something else if they don't help by themselves. Supplements and special diets are the next steps in helping your stressed cat. Various ingredients like L-theanine, milk whey proteins, magnolia, and philodendron extracts have research showing they may help a stressed cat and can be found in items like soliquin and zyokin, and even special cat foods like Royal Canin's Calm Diet. If necessary, stressed cats may need a combination of pheromones, supplements, diets, and even medications. Fluoxetine, gabapentin, amitriptyline, and other prescription items may be recommended by your veterinarian for stress cases that cannot be addressed with other modalities. Depending on the situation, these may need to be given temporarily or long-term but if you can help your cat feel less stressed then whatever you need to do is worth it. A visit to vets. Whilst there are lots of things you can do at home to help manage and reduce stress in your cat, it is also advisable that you take your cat to a vet to be checked over, especially if you have detected a problem with your cat's physical health, for example, weight loss or signs of cystitis. If you notice a difference in your cat's behavior or think your cat may be stressed, the first step is to visit your veterinarian. There may be underlying medical issues that are causing your cat to feel stressed or act out. Once medical issues are ruled out, consider consulting a veterinary behaviorist. A behaviorist will help you determine what exactly you are dealing with, what would be a likely outcome, and how you can achieve it. With a little help, your cat may get to a point where they can tolerate that full-on house renovation you have planned, after all. Seeking professional behavioral advice. In addition to all the advice provided in this video, it is also recommended that you consult a suitably qualified cat behavior specialist, who will be able to provide more detailed advice specific and tailored to your cat and situation. Professional behavior specialists, also known as pet behavior counselors, can only work with you if you are referred to them by your vet, so speak to your vet first as they may be able to recommend someone straight away, or suggest that you contact someone of your choice before arranging the referral. Behavior specialists have to go through a rigorous assessment process to achieve formal qualifications or certification, to ensure the advice and support they provide is of the highest standard. Some cats need anti-anxiety medicine to help them break the stress cycle. These medications do have potential side effects and must be carefully dosed. Your veterinarian can help you determine whether one is necessary for your cat and, if so, prescribe it. Never give your cat any medicine without your veterinarian's approval.